Five months after Ted Kennedy's death, voters in Massachusetts are heading to the polls today to pick a new senator for the seat Kennedy and the Democrats have held for nearly a half century. Polls show a dead heat between Democratic State Attorney General Martha Coakley and Republican State Senator Scott Brown. Brown's campaign is surging. The Democrats have launched a full-court press to fight him off. President Barack Obama capped off the effort with a rally in Boston for Coakley over the weekend. Now, there's been a lot said in this race about how it's not the Kennedy seat. It's the people's seat. And let me tell you, the first person who would agree with that was Ted Kennedy. Losing the seat would be devastating for the Democrats. It would eliminate their 60-seat supermajority in the Senate and put many of the party's planned goals in serious jeopardy, including health care reform. Brown, meanwhile, has been crisscrossing the state in the final days before the election, imploring supporters to keep up the effort. And make sure that you tell all your friends to get out and vote. Do not take anything for granted. The last time Massachusetts voted to send a Republican to the Senate was back in 1972. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.